speedrunning the seed discord in Minecraft. So as you can see I'm grabbing the bed and food from the first house. And now I'm entering the blacksmith. I get 11 obsidian which I was not expecting but no iron, so I will have to compromise on the route a bit. I decide to craft a wooden sword and start killing the iron golem. I kill it and luckily it drops 5 iron ingots. I craft my tools, and then begin mining some wood. After I finish collecting the wood, I decide to make my portal at the blacksmith. I try using wood to light the portal, but I mess up. Luckily there's some water next to extinguish me. After some scuffed wood lighting, I enter the nether in under 3 minutes. I start mining some nether gold ore, and make myself some golden boots, to get protection from piglins. After a bit of traveling, I enter the bastion at 4 minutes. I build up and enter the top rampart of the bastion. I get my piglin hole ready, and then start performing my bastion route. While I play this bastion, I'd like to talk about the sponsor of this video. My Discord server. We just hit 100 server members, and it means a lot to me. So I'd love to keep expanding this server, and getting more people to join. So if you haven't already it'll mean the world to me. I appreciate each and every single one of you. Anyways, we are reaching the end of the bastion here. I don't have many pearls, so I have to be conservative. I pearl out of the bastion at 8 minutes. I start making my way towards the fortress. Unfortunately, I need to be conservative with my pearl throws, because it is a one eye. Or that is what I thought. Because you will actually see later in the run, that it is a three eye. If I had remembered this, the run could have been over 90 seconds faster. Anyways, I reach my fortress. Luckily it is in a soul sand valley meaning lots of stray blaze spawns. I start killing blazes. I only get one rod from the first three blazes. However, I start killing more blazes and all of the next four blazes drop. Ideally, I should have left now, but I forgot that I only needed five rods, so I killed four more blazes and didn't get a blaze rod. While getting the blaze rods, I also managed to get a wither skeleton skull, and just after, that a blaze rod from the next blaze. I pearl out of the fortress, and I start building my nether portal to get back in the overworld. Surprise. Surprise. I spawn in the stronghold. Because I am low on hunger, I need to walk to the portal room. This is when I realize that the portal had three eyes filled in it. I pull out of bed and try to kill myself using lava. However, I realize I have fire resistance. So after a bit of scuffed playing, I kill myself using suffocation to reset my health and hunger bars. I then fill in my eyes, sort out my inventory, and get ready to kill the dragon. After I reach the center fountain, the dragon immediately perches. I throw an ender pearl to activate quadruple damage. I build a tower and place lava on top of it to slow down the dragon. However, I placed it on the wrong spot, so I have to go back and do it again. I then blow up the beds in quick succession killing the dragon. I hop into the end portal. And that is how I beat Minecraft on the seed discord in 17 minutes and 31 seconds. Subscribe.